Hello there everybody, and welcome to my hardcore Minecraft series. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, because I enjoyed making it. So right off the bat, I, uh, I just, you know, sit at my desk, quite happy that Minecraft is back up and running again. Um, I sit there and talk to myself for a second, thinking about what I'm going to be doing. I finally figure it out, and I'm just like, you know what, mm, why not? Why not, you know, do hardcore? So, I load in, change it to hardcore, change the name to eyeball, seeing as it was the first thing that popped into my head. Change the world to, to something completely random, I just, literally just smacked my keyboard, and that was that. I created the world and uh, waited for it to load in. I uh, sat there, clicked on my screen a few times just cause, and then uh, I loaded in, walked around a few for a little bit. Okay, so it spawns near a plains biome and an acacia forest. Awesome. Something that I like to do is I'll go and mine uh, several trees, just enough for me to be able to have enough tools and stuff ready for wherever I may be going. Do that. So let me get some get some wood. Make this crafting a lifetime. Probably not, but you know, hey, it's a good feeling to have that much wood. I went down into a cave. Immediately saw iron as I was heading down, so I decided, hey, I need a real, I really, really need to grab this iron. This is gonna be super duper beneficial. Made myself a, a stone pickaxe, even though you know I missed making, uh, trying to make it the first few times. Noticed two creepers. I was like, hmm, big brain play time. Come on, come on out, come on out, mates. Come on, yup. Shot my spider. I should have known you weren't gonna be a friendly. Oh no. Back to mining this sweet, sweet iron. Mind up the iron. Had a nice jubilant, jubilant time. Found my way to the top of a hill after coming out of the, out of that cave. Found plenty and plenty of animals, enough for food, smelting, you know what, whatever. Got my, sorry, smelting up my iron and uh, decided to start making myself some tools. Here I made myself a leather cap, which I would be wearing the entire rest of the, uh, the entire rest of the video and, you know, forget about it at some point. Forget that it was even on my head. I decided to wait a second before I make my stuff, realizing that I don't have the sticks I need. Grab a little bit more iron. Hmm. You're gonna die soon, Mr. Cow. Don't worry. Make myself an axe. Make myself a pickaxe, because I definitely need that. Almost made a mistake and made myself a <laughs> two iron pickaxes, which could have been very, uh, you know, not cool. A few pairs of pants, maybe? Not for now. Just make. Keep it. Okay. You ready? Now I can go to sleep. So a little trick to know if um a little trick to know that you can go to sleep is that um the moon the sun and the moon will be uh, parallel to each other. And that's the signal that like uh like, what did I break that? This is a signal meaning that uh, you can go ahead and go to sleep. Looked over at the sheep, was like, hey guys, went back over, grabbed myself some mutton because I was nearly, nearly dead of starvation. That would have sucked. Um, looked out, ate a little bit of beef, and then just kind of like stared. Grabbed a little bit more mutton, went, went into a new cave, found more iron. That's always good. 
I'm slowly gaining enough iron to get myself more stuff. Saw some more iron. I was like, gotta go mine that. Always make sure though when mining to never ever go mining without torches. Grab this coal from right there. Next thing I'm gonna make is a shield. Oh, please. Okay. No, but I, I still just want to be on the safe side. You never know. That could be the last piece of coal you ever mine. In a, in a world. And you don't even know it. Need. And I was like, you know what? I need to turn down my freaking render distance. I am going to hurt my computer. How nice. Went back. And then looked around for a quick second. Six my FPS. Hey, smooth sixty. Check the day. We're sitting at a good old uh, deal one. Grab my coal. Grab my iron. Made myself a little bit of iron armor. Nothing, nothing special. Just a little bit of iron boots, iron pants. Nothing too crazy. Put those on. Already had my chest plate. Feeling good, strong. Like, look at me. I'm Freaking powerhouse right there. Don't freaking mess with me, bro. Freaking punch you with my, uh, my seeds. Yeah. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. Kill the. Okay. Bed down. And there we go. I don't want to be up too long. Puts me at extreme risk of. Look, I. Uh, what am I thinking? How much iron is that going to be? So. To make the helmet and the. Uh, what else was I going to make? Back up. Uh, I'm such a gravelly voice. I'm not. I don't sound appealing. Okay. One, two, three. What's that? That's enough to make a helmet. So I'm gonna make the helmet, yes. Nah. Eh, should I? I don't know. I'm torn. Okay. Um, found some surface iron, which always feels really nice to see. Always does. Use my water bucket. Got up higher. Felt pretty good. Running around, running around, looking for a good spot to start my new home. Because I didn't want to just be, you know, running around scavenging for the rest of my life. That would suck. And that wouldn't make for a really fun, interesting thing to watch, I think. That's just what I'm saying. Fell down here on accident, uh, looking around and saw one of the little freaking hell babies chasing me. It lit me on fire. Thought out for sure I was going to die there when I wasn't hitting my attacks on it. Accidentally placed down a bed. Almost died. Five hearts right there. Cocomelon, Cocomelon, oh yeah, ooh. Going pretty darn good. Notice I had enough. Grab some birch wood. Even though some people hate birch wood, I think it's a pretty good looking block, especially after having used it for, you know, most of my, uh, most of the video. <laughs> Maybe I can use it to make like a patio or something. But, nonetheless, set this down. Uh, boom. I'm just gonna put that right there. Lower this a little bit more. The saplings, don't know why I grabbed them, just did. Started mining away at that dirt. Wasn't really hard. Just a couple of, you know, Smacks here and there, and boom, you're done. Roughly. So how to, you know, mine it, make it look good, make, widen the platform in it to enable me to have an actual house, not just, you know, you know whatever this is. It's a, you know, floating dirt platform with a crafting table in it. 
ridiculous amount of leaves. But hey, that's besides the point. Nobody's caring, right? Right? Okay, cool. So, uh, first thing I do, make sure I get all these stupid pesky leaves out of the way. Weren't budging. Didn't, like, you know, despawn. So hadn't noticed that I had a, uh, had a leather helmet on. Don't know how. Looked up. Decided to build. One, two, three, four. As you should. People that, you know, don't, people that like having a two block high home are, you know, weird. It's really, really, really weird. Don't know why they would do that. Anyways. Day three, I started to finish up my house. Wanted to make it, you know, livable. Not just a couple of posts with a bed in the middle. It's not, it's not a house. this point I hope you guys know what that means as we place down the bed wait to be able to see the moon partially I decided, hey, let's go to bed. Yay! First sunrise that I actually watch. Felt pretty good. So, I look around. Punch the air for some reason again. Don't know why. Kind of wish I had Octifine be able to make looking around at stuff a lot easier. I, uh, sat there AFK for, like, a few seconds. Don't know why. I was just, like, there. Came back. Somehow didn't even realize I was freaking gone. I don't know why. Check the furnaces. Kept hitting the same one. Not trying to get my steak. Which kind of sucked. Had plenty of enough steak, pork chops, and mutton to last me a lifetime. Probably.
I love to make up random voices, I really do. Oh my god, is that a creep right there? Let's go to bed. So once again, uh, you know, uh, oh, oh, day five already. Hello creeper, good morning to you, good sir. Hmm. I wonder if I should start working on the farm. No, no. It has been a good five days. A long time of recording. So, all in all, thank you guys so very much. Nah, I guess I can't say that because it's not like the end of it. Then finally decided, oh yeah, I got something to do I need to do, do to do. Remembered I was gonna make my need to make myself some food, so I'm making a farm. Need to make sure I was not just gonna have to survive on meat, and I was gonna need you know other food items for later, especially for different places that I'm going to have to travel to. Seeing as you know, won't be always be able to get everything. Start off from right here. Mm -hmm. That bridge that was gonna take me to my farm. I made it a little bit too wide for my own liking, and uh, you know, I was just like, yeah, I'm not feeling that. That doesn't look. That doesn't look good. Made it a rush to get back to my home. Didn't want to. Uh, miss the sunset as well as I didn't want to be eaten by mobs because that you know that sucks uh, looked at it around my land a few times thought about what I could do saw that sand I was like hmm, definitely gotta fill that in don't know why I punched the ceiling but went to bed and another very good night just you know, sad I think this is going pretty good. Day number six. Okay. Ooh. Jump. What you guys get? Well, I mean, like that one. That just that scent. That heavenly, just like either whether it be cooking or just like white. I finally decided on having it at three, and that seemed to be working just fine. Enough room for me to walk around, and uh, yeah, be able to access my be able to access my farm. Don't try to be too rude and annoying. Ooh, cut it just in time. <laughs> D 
A7. Yikes, am I tired? Um, I'm just gonna sit here for a little, a little bit and fish. A ruined fortress. A, a ruined portal. What's in here? Okay. Huh. Awesome. Oh, oh. I'm gonna grab this. For now, cows will stay. I'm gonna make. Alrighty, cool. Chill there, guys. I'm sorry, my voice is so quiet. Uh, yeah, this way. <laughs> and my base. Never stress. Never late. Sun. Hey, I finally did it right. You keep growing, you. Maybe I should make a sugar cane farm. I have a strange urge to watch Wreck-It Ralph. I don't know why. I love the movie. Slaps, uh, facts. Slaps, facts. That sounds kind of interesting. Slap, like, help for new, new players, I mean, I guess. I just, wow, that's a lot more, a lot more glass than I need. Well, I guess I get a view out of every side, I guess. Uh-huh. 
I'm so funny. Good night, Mr. Bum. be day 10, the sunrise of day 10, and that means I uh, have nearly two hours of footage for five days, that's truly incredible, gear to never end it up, like everything gets to the right, <gasps> a book, <gasps> oh my god, oh, oh my god, oh my god, god, Might and loyalty. Oh my god. <sighs> Bro. If I missed that jump, or if I missed that water splash, I would have. Let's just not think about that, yeah? in your quick quick what is it I do believe it's the uh, the quick maker that's what I'm gonna call it from now on it's gonna be the quick maker you can put the two of them uh, two of the same identical things such as you know axes armor it'll just strip off enchantments of them if um if you have enchantments so be mindful of that always want to get a anvil as well but if you just have no Nothing with an enchantment on, then yeah, that definitely works. Woke up, day ten. Day ten, how about that? We made it. Thirteen levels, full dish iron armor. Thanks for putting that in there, Jay. Very nice of you. Bye, guys. <laughs>